Now that your virtual tour has gone live, I wanted to show you a couple different ways to share or embed your virtual tour in Facebook. Now the first way is just a link. When your visitors click it, it sends them directly to Google Maps and they can take the virtual tour there. Unfortunately, it does take them away from your Facebook page. Now the next way is to actually post a 360 photo right into your Facebook post. This is a lot more interactive and interesting. It's keeping your visitors engaged and on your Facebook page. Now the third way is a custom Facebook tab. This is useful because it lets your visitors take the virtual tour anytime they want. Now to post a link, simply click on the virtual tour in the carousel at the bottom of Google Maps, go up to the upper left corner, share and embed the image, shorten that URL, copy it, and paste it right into a post on Facebook. Make sure it says your company name, add a custom image, and publish it. Now to add a 360 photo, go to your gallery page at Columbia Pix, download your 360 photos, and simply drag and drop them right into a Facebook post. Facebook recognizes them as 360 photos and you can publish them. To create a custom Facebook tab, you need to install the Woobox app. Click on this link, it's also in the description. Sign in using Facebook, create a new HTML fangate tab, and you'll see a text box which is where you'll paste your code. Switch back over to Google Maps, go to embed image, and grab that code that you use to embed this on your website. Switch back to the fangate page, and paste it in the text box. Save your settings and go to tab settings on the left to change the way that it's displayed on Facebook. I hope that was helpful. Send me a message if you have any questions.